Hey, what's going on guys? If you are seeing this before the video, it means that my audio for some reason screwed up and it has like the weird deep voice modifier that sometimes it gets on it. Uh, and I swear to God, if I see, oh, bang of hey, puberty in the comments from you little 11 and 12 year old idiot kids, I'm gonna lose my fucking mind and it'll be the last comment you ever leave on one of my videos. Anyway, I <laughs> hope you guys enjoy, see ya. What is going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video. Has my, has my intro been changing from video to video? I don't know. I don't like it. Anyway, this is the team in this episode of Power of Peterson. We have recently added Larry Little to the squad. He will be making his debut as this is the team. Many upgrades to be made on defense. We don't have any upgrade points, so we need to go get into a game, get those points. I had a comment um, from, I believe it was Aaron Judge is his account, and he said, Bengal, I don't know the rules. Like, I watch the videos and I do listen, but I don't know the rules. So these are the rules on the screen. Um, 100 yards rushing is an upgrade. 100 yards receiving is an upgrade. Now, there are some that are not listed, which I can't understand your confusion. One touchdown is an upgrade. Three touchdowns is a tier skip in the same game. And then 296 all-purpose yards, so rushing and receiving combined, um, is actually two tier skips. If you get 150 all-purpose yards, that is an upgrade in itself. And those are pretty much all the rules. You can upgrade the different tiers are as follows. Um, you have gold. You have low elite, 80 to 84. You have mid-tier elite, 85 to 89. And then you have the 90 to 95, because like that's as high as it goes right now. And then eventually, if we make it that far in the series, it will be 96 to 99. So I don't know how long the series is going to go. Um, we are already at, I believe, 9 or 10 episodes. And this is a super fun series. I love recording it. And I know you guys have been loving it as well. I appreciate so much of the support. You guys have been awesome in the comments section below. You continue to show me that love in the comments with the like button and everything. But we got Sir Coach a lot here. His team's kind of ass. He's got Ravens, Randall, Cunningham. I don't know. Let me go ahead and make my screen bigger for y'all. I think it's just easier if I position myself in the bottom right. At least for me when editing. But Sir Coach a lot 49 hopefully is trash at the game and we can see him roll him. Adrian Peterson can go off, get a ton of upgrades. Those two tier skips for 296 total yards would be awesome. However, it's just so unlikely of that ever happening. It's just like if it does, it's crazy. And again, like it should almost be three tier skips, because it's just so wild if that were to ever happen. That's literally like, I think impossible. We haven't even come close. That is a user pick. Easy reads. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. And as long as we can get some stuff going offensively, this game's going to be a breeze. Here we go. Adrian Peterson. Up the middle. Oh my goodness, Adrian Peterson. Get off me. The truck. Oh my goodness, Adrian Peterson is an 18-wheeler coming through the middle of the field. What a start to this game. I would almost leave if I were Sir Coach Lott. That's disrespectful. That's disrespect at the highest level. Adrian Peterson is an absolute army grade military tank coming through the middle of the field, bowling over anyone in his way. 7-0. That's an upgrade already. Fumble! Recover, please! Oh my goodness. If this is someone that stays in the game... We can get points on him. My word, what a start to this episode. Adrian Peterson has taps. Adrian, oh my goodness, he goes down from that. He just come, he comes out in such a weak box. Adrian, end zone, touchdown, two upgrades on the day. It's the first quarter. We've been playing for a minute. This I feel like this game's already over. How did this guy get to pro? Like he got unlucky with the, uh, with the fumble. That's it. Dude, who is playing right now? What is going on? Also, I didn't mention at the start, a rage quit is a tier skip, and an upgrade is a win, or a win is an upgrade. He's gonna go deep. Willie Cooker in coverage. I mean, like, does this guy know you can actually hold down the button and throw it harder? I don't think so. This is an odd game. I don't think this guy, how are you in this division? How did you make it to pro? 
I, there's no way this guy's ever won a game. I can't believe that there'd be anyone worse than this guy. Like, I think it's just the fact, dude. I, like, he's lobbing every pass. I thought it was an interception. That's picked up. P.J. Williams, for shame. There it is. P.J. Williams made up for it. I'm actually just going to go out of bounds. Adrian Peterson, that's why. I think the, the game's already in the bag. Here we go. Oh my gosh, Adrian Peterson. Go, go, go. He's diving. Okay, backflip. That's bad. 78 yards already on the ground, though, for AP. This is, this is crazy. This is the 296 yards in one game game. That's two tier skips if we can get there. And it's just total yards. Oh my goodness, the screen was diagnosed. Or not the screen, the pitch was diagnosed well. You know, Adrian's actually staying in the game on third and six. Another inside handoff. And he tackled me on that? What? No way. Great pass from Jared Goff under pressure. Phenomenal. And now Adrian Peterson should be back in the game on first down. Here's Adrian. Oh my goodness. Adrian, burn him. Burn him. Burn him. How did he make that tackle? Adrian's over 100 on the day. That's an upgrade. Adrian up the middle. Oh my god, he got tripped up. He's down to the one there. Another upgrade over 100. So we're still at three. Fourth and goal. I'm going for it. Looking for Adrian Peterson as a receiver. And it's not down at the line. Unbelievable. He was open too. That's so crazy, man. Wow, how did I not score there? He just thinks all you can do is lob the ball. I don't get it. And he only passes. It's pretty wild. There's the safety. All right, next step is 100 receiving yards for AP. Because that would be another upgrade in itself. That is the new goal. He's blitzing a lot. There's Adrian. He dropped the ball. Okay. It's a man blitz. There's AP. There's AP up the middle. Adrian Peterson, go. There's a juke to the outside. Adrian Peterson is gone. Look at him go. AP touchdown. There's the third touchdown. There's a tear skip. There's our fourth upgrade of the game. And we're ever closer to 100 receiving yards, which would be another upgrade. And 296 total yards, which would be two tier skips as we discussed before the game it would be uh i didn't think about this so it's not going to count obviously but what if we cross off everything on a list that's possible um you know 100 receiving yards 100 rushing yards 296 total yards three touchdowns a rage quit is he gonna leave is he gonna leave i am uh just three yards away from 150 total yards which would be yet another upgrade and he is unpaused. I almost wonder if I want to let him in the end zone here. I'm going to do it again. I need to let him in the end zone. I need to make him think he's still in this game. Dude, you are killing me, man. I'm literally I'm trying to let you have this without letting you know that I'm letting you have it. He barely had enough time. He makes decisions so slow. Throw the ball. Throw the ball. Throw the, throw the ball. This guy. <laughs> I'm trying to give it to him. Horrific. Like, I'm not even messing around here. This is maybe the worst player I've ever played. And we are in pro for second string. Pro second string. Which isn't a high division, I know. But still. I tried to, like, switch on there and, and run away. This is pitiful, man. <laughs> like, that's the only word I can say. This is absolutely pitiful from Sir Coach a lot. He is not even coachable. I, I doubt it. Maybe he does a lot of coaching. He definitely can't play. Throwing across the body. Adrian Peterson. Very close to the end zone. Also, someone in the comments suggested that like, every touchdown after your third touchdown should be a tier skip on top of that. I just don't agree with that, so I think it would be, if we get another three touchdowns, it'd be a tier skip. It would just happen to be in the same game, which would be kind of cool. Adrian breaking tackles, powering end zone, touchdown. 
Oh my goodness, his fourth on the day. I shouldn't even be surprised at this point. I'm going to try here. I'm going to run commit. He's going to have to make a quick decision. That's who you throw to? God. Dude, like, seriously? I'm going to do the same thing. Throw to your streak. I wish you could hear me. Throw to your streak. Throw to your streak. Oh my goodness. He's done it. He's done it. He scored. Unbelievable. The impossible has happened. I literally thought it was impossible. I'm literally trying to hand it to him. And he can't even do it. He's finally done. It'd be funny if his one goal was to score and then he just quits the game. <laughs> oh, that would have been, would have been bad. Streak, uh, Evan Ingram. Streak, JJ Nelson. Adrian could be wide open. And he is. There's a spin back. Adrian Peterson's gone. Adrian Peterson. There's a juke. Adrian Peterson. Go. Go. He got tackled. No. Oh my god. Almost. Adrian Peterson. Six catches. 147 yards. We are so close to 296. It's unreal. I'm actually kind of getting a lot of lag right now. Just bad timing. If he comes out in cover four again. I'm just going to go with the draw. I think the draw could be wide open. You get Adrian another touchdown. Up the middle. Adrian, you got the truck. And he does. Oh my goodness. Throws him off. Get off me. Another touchdown. Adrian's fifth on the day. If he gets to six, that's another tier skip. And you, you guys can tell me in the comments if I hit a goal twice, like 200 rushing yards or 200 receiving yards, like, should that be like a tier skip? And you can see the lag there. That's unreal. Should that be, like, another tier skip on top of where the upgrade should have been? Like, for example, three rushing touchdowns is a tier skip. We have we have the, uh, like, we have five <laughs> upgrades for five rushing touchdowns. And um, we have a tier skip from three rushing touchdowns, as the rules indicate. But if we were to hit a goal twice, that's a tier skip. So, like, six rushing touchdowns. Should that then be like another tier skip, skip on top of what the, like a tier skip would have been because if we score a six rushing touchdown i know i'm not articulating this well that's going to be another tier skip but that should that be like another just because we hit it twice i don't know let me know down in the comments we're obviously going to upgrade at the end of the episode so i'll have to address it potentially in next episode if that's what you guys decide but like we're literally going off here the lag is insane right now i feel like this dude's coming after my router Adrian's almost got 296 total yards, which would be two tier skips, which would be too ridiculous. There he goes. Lag, lag, come on. <laughs> I'm pissed. If this guy comes out in cover two invert again, I have now inserted Adrian Peterson as a wide receiver, running a post. Hopefully we can hit him deep down the field for the touchdown. This is not what that is. This is something else entirely. And we're sacked. I think he started to clue in on Adrian Peterson. <laughs> I think he might know. Or maybe he was just showcasing his sick users. But, like, I can't react with this uh, with this lag. Can't even throw the ball. There's Adrian. Oh, my goodness. Adrian Peterson. Purple Jesus to the end zone. That's his sixth touchdown. That's another tier skip. It's another upgrade for the touchdown. It's more yards. That's probably 296 total yards. We're going to check in a minute. Which should be two tier skips. We thought it'd be impossible. At the beginning of this episode, I was saying, that's never going to happen. Never going to happen. Never going to happen. Well, guess what? I think it's happened. We're only at the start of the third. I'm going to calculate some upgrades real quick. See if we can do that. Player stats, Adrian Peterson has 124 rushing yards, so that's an upgrade. He has four touchdowns, so that's four upgrade points for the four touchdowns. Five overall so far. It's a tier skip for three touchdowns. Receiving, he has 200 receiving yards over, so that's two upgrade points. He has two touchdowns, so that's two upgrades there. And that's six total, so it's another tier skip. We can upgrade for the win. I'd like him to rage quit. That seems unlikely, given what's transpired already. That'd be a tier skip if we were to rage quit. This game's gross. I don't do. Do I want to end it now, or do I want to keep playing around with this guy? It's just so. I mean, get the upgrades while I can, right? Why not? This is gonna be the biggest jump 
ever in terms of uh, team overall. Because we're just going to make so many upgrades. It's unreal. We have just so many points. Like, I could, I didn't even count them all. I just said what they were. But, like, jeez. Definitely going to get over 10 rushing yards. I didn't even mention there's two tier skips for 296 total yards when I was going over the stats. It's unbelievable. Like, this literally seems like a fake episode. Dude seems like a plant. It's just the, the episode that we really needed to go like this. It's not like we really needed to get an insane team right now. Um, but it's like, this is just the most upgrades I could even imagine. We're going to check off every single box. In some cases, even more than once. As he has 200 receiving yards. He's going to have 200 rushing yards, probably. Like, that's a problem. <laughs> just insane. The lag is insane as well. He's going to roll out again. He's going to take off. Nice. I literally can't even move. I'm going to pick this off. Nope. Literally, the lag took me so far away from the play. Great score, guy. Like, I just don't even feel like turning on shoe clock. Because this is the rarest opportunity of all time. So it's like, we got to take advantage of this. There's just so much lag. I can't move now. If the game started like this, oh, I would have been fuming. The funny thing is, I don't even know how it's like this. It just started so randomly. But you see a lag spike right there, kind of out of nowhere, right there. We're going to snap the ball. And then it was like okay after the snap, but not really. We might not get 200 uh, rushing yards. There's Adrian. Like, the lag is making it so... Oh, my goodness. The lag saved me somehow. It's not even lagging right now. Look at Adrian Peterson, man. I'll take the touchdown. You can't catch me. You can't. It's another touchdown. Another crazy game for Adrian. I would have had that anyway. But, like, the lag made it so I couldn't even move, really. It was just kind of controlling it for me. Like, half a second after I input uh, the button. Well, that's a huge run for AP. Another touchdown. The lag kind of stopped, too. That's going to be an easy read, though. User pick. Good night, Moon. I didn't even want to go out of bounds there, fun fact. Another big gain. 218 yards rushing. Five touchdowns. Gross. Here we go. Another pitch. Adrian Peterson. Look at the, the lag is so brutal. Like, that's an easy first down if there's no lag. Such an easy first down, and I just can't do it. I wouldn't be complaining about this lag if it wasn't, like, as bad as it was. Like, you guys can definitely see it, too. There goes Adrian Peterson, though. And that is another touchdown. <laughs> I never even made a goal for 296 rushing yards because I'm like, that's not even possible. As the lag gets me again. But here we are in a game, I think, extremely close to 296 rushing yards. Unbelievable stuff, man. Like, I don't even... This episode seems fake. Like, I almost don't even want to let it count. Cause it feels like I'm playing someone mentally disabled, but it's like we gotta we gotta make the upgrades count. Obviously, the whole point of play. Like I've seen less vicious pounding as interracial gangbangs. Like this is ridiculous. Oh no! Did I accidentally leave that open for the touchdown? Oh no! What a mistake! Here's the handoff, and he's wrapped up, and he's going to call a timeout. Why did I see that coming? Such a peculiar creature is Sir Coach Lot 49. So much lag, and Adrian fumbled the ball. We recovered, though. It was Larry Little with the quick hands. Adrian's first fumble on the day, as we are over 300 rushing yards. Adrian Peterson has broken his own record for most rushing yards in a game. <laughs> He's gonna call timeout. Does this guy wanna see what I can do? The stat line's wild, man. 
Like this is this is an unbelievable game. I'll call a timeout. Fuck it. I'm gonna try this pitch to Adrian. It's a cheese run play. TT23 obviously told me about it. And there's Adrian Peterson. 29 rushes, 333 yards, and six touchdowns. Let's go ahead and calculate these upgrades for real. All right. Rushing, Adrian. That's 333 yards. So. <laughs> We have no rules for, like, 296 rushing yards in a game. Like, that's not a thing. Um, although, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to word myself a tier skip for that. Because, like, that's unreal. And it, it should be even two, but we're just going to do it at one because it wasn't a rule going into this. But I think it's warranted. That's three upgrades for each hundred yards. So, I need to write this down somewhere. This is just ridiculous. Um, so, that is... So far, so for... The 300 yards, that's three upgrades and one tier skip. Six touchdowns is six upgrades, and that's a tier skip for, for three touchdowns. It's a tier skip for another three touchdowns. It's two tier skips. This is just running the football. Also, 150 total yards twice is two upgrades for that. We don't even have them receiving yet. Um, 216 receiving yards. That's two upgrades. And two touchdowns. That's two upgrades. So we have overall just an insane amount of upgrades. It's 300 plus 216. Or excuse me, 333 plus 216. I think we just missed out on another um, upgrade. Hold on. 333. I, I'm stupid. I, I hate math. 549. We missed it by one yard, I believe. But it's so for total yards, um, the 216 plus 333 is 549. So it's 150, 150, it's 300. Um, so that's, that's two upgrades for total yards. Um, and then 450 is another upgrade so that's another two upgrade on top of that so what i wrote down here is three upgrades six upgrades is nine upgrades two more upgrades is 11 two more is 13 two more is 15 we have 15 upgrades and three tier skips and an upgrade for the win so 16 upgrades and three tier skips. Wow. I think I did all that math correct. I'm not a math guy. I'm a word guy, as you guys probably know. 16 upgrades and three tier skips. Unreal. Unreal. This is this is such a long episode. Hope you guys like it. I get my quick sell pack, whatever this is gonna be. Probably eight coins. 2,000? 4,000. I'll take it. Um, but holy hell. We are now 2-0. We win 56-21. to 21. What? I'm so confused at the last game. Like, 16 upgrades is so many. This team is going to look totally different. 16 so many. All right, let's do it. 16 upgrades, not to even mention fucking tier skips. This is going to be expensive, too. First thing I'm addressing is the linebacking core. I'm going to use a lot of upgrades here. There's <laughs> so many. All right, so I'm going to get this Terrell Suggs, 280K for 91 Terrell Suggs. Now, that's not going to count as a tier skip. What I'm doing is just skipping... Some phases so I don't have to worry about, you know, putting a player, putting in a player, putting in a player, just to, you know, upgrade from them initially. So Michael Kendricks to a low 80 uh, to 84 is going to be one upgrade. To an 85 to 89 is two upgrades. And then it's another upgrade to get to 90 to 95. So we're going to go ahead and put Terrell Suggs in on the lineup. 
That's going to count as three upgrades. So we are down to 13 already. Terrence Mitchell is also gone. Now he is a gold. So I'm going to do the same thing for him. So low elite, mid elite, high elite. Another three upgrades. So we are down to 10. And in comes 92 Darius Slay. Are you kidding me? 92 Darius Slay. It's another three upgrades. He's an absolute beast. I didn't, I'll show the stats on Terrell Suggs in a minute. But Darius Lay, 92 speed, 91 excel, 91 agility, 91 man, 90 zone, 84 press, 94 play ref, 79 catching. He's got the pick six camp. He is an absolute beast. Boosted up to 91 man. Here's also what I'm going to do. I'm going to upgrade PJ Williams. Um, I'm going to count this as two upgrades. And then I'm going to use my third. So I'm going to put in 91 Terrence Newman right um so that counts as two upgrades and then rashawn melvin is gone i'm bringing back in pj williams and that's an upgrade so that's three upgrades all together just to make that happen so somehow i still have seven upgrades left after that i'm gonna address the middle linebacker position it's finally time for josh perry to go and i'm going to be using my first tier skip so we're skipping gold altogether and going to low elite, I guess. Actually, no, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to bring in Dale Buchanan. And to do that, I am using one upgrade to upgrade to a gold. And then a tier skip to pass low elite to mid elite. If you see how that happened. So that is one upgrade and one tier skip gone. So we have six upgrades and two tier skips left. This is, this is crazy. I'm also uploading, or up, excuse me, upgrading from Marvin Jones. Marvin Jones is going to still be on the team. I'm just doing this in the best way that I can to save upgrade points. So I'm going to use a tier skip. So I only have one tier skip left after I use this to get 91 Stefan Diggs onto the team. Powered up. He's an absolute beast. I'm trying to get a lot of Vikings players into this lineup. Um, I think for obvious reasons, so Adrian's a little bit better. Like, they all kind of mesh together and play better off themselves. And Stefan Diggs is incredible. 89 speed, 88 catching, 88 elusiveness, 90 spectacular catch, 87 release, 90 route running, 88 catching traffic, 84 jumping. He's an absolute monster. He's in the team. So that is one upgrade. Or no, that's, that was just a tier skip, actually. I'm going to use an upgrade on Marquise Lee to get Marvin Jones back to the team. Where is he? There he is. And I'm going to use a tier skip on JJ Nelson to bring in Randy Moss. 90 speed, 86 catching, 82 elusiveness, 90 spectacular catch, 84 release, 85 route running, 81 catch and traffic, 90 jumping. It's Randy freaking Moss, dude. He's an absolute beast. And then I'm going to use another upgrade point. That was my last tier skip, by the way, to exchange Desmond Lewis for JJ Nelson and bring JJ Nelson right back into the team. So I now have five upgrades left. I am all out of tier skips. This team is kind of disgusting now. 84 overall. It's getting it's getting pretty gross. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. And I think I'm going to spend him on the defensive side of the ball. Uh, I really like Lee Cooker, but I think his time with us might be done. I have five upgrades left. It'd be silly not to upgrade defensive line and safeties. I guess left outside linebacker could use a boost. I don't know what I'm going to do just yet. All right, I'm going to use another two upgrades, which... I, Two upgrades is basically a tier skip. Uh, and I'm going to get 91 Olivier Vernon. I think he would be absolutely sick on the team, so that's what I'm going to do. 336K is going to get it done for Olivier Vernon. He's a monster, though. 77 speed, 91 block shed, 95 power move. As you can see, 82 fast move, 91 play rec, 90 tackle, 83 acceleration. And his 88 or 89 card was an absolute joke. So I expect this 91 to be just unreal. Goodbye, John Abraham. You have served us well. But in comes 91, Olivier Vernon. And hello, John Abraham. His 85 card is an absolute joke. Like, I know I keep saying that this, look at this 85. Tell me it's an 85. 80 speed, 86 strength, 86 tackle, 92 playback, 85 block shed, 89 power move, 83 finesse move, and then 75 to power. Tell me that's an 85 overall card. That card is that card is ridiculous. That's two upgrade points. So we're down to our final upgrade as this team's gone. Just it's ridiculous. 
is absolutely ridiculous now. Uh, and I know I said I wanted to upgrade Kicker. And I still haven't done that. I could do that now. But I don't think I'm going to. <laughs> I actually am using my final upgrade point on a kicker. Nick Novak. 76 kick power. 78 kick accuracy. He is the final upgrade onto the team after... I can tell you guys... The craziest episode you will ever see. It doesn't get better than this. This was the most upgrades we're ever going to have. Um... But we do finally have a kicker better than Giorgio Tavecchio, who had 66 kick power, 69 kick accuracy. We got someone who's at least a little bit better now. Actually, I'm going to make him kickoff specialist, too. There's no way Giorgio Tavecchio stays on the team. Goodbye, Giorgio. All right, guys, so that was quite an episode. We have used our upgrade points, I want to say, fairly well. J.J. Nelson stays in the team. Marvin Jones stays in the team. I'm going to actually switch him with Randy Moss, I think, for obvious reasons, again. Get Randy Moss actually in. We go up to an 85 overall now. Stefan Diggs is in the team now. 91 Stefan Diggs. Those were all the offensive upgrades. I mainly focused on the defensive side of the ball. I think Evan Ingram's fine, but defensively, the only player who stayed in their same spot was Malik Hooker, Terrence Brooks, Daniil Hunter, Clinton McDonald, and Danny Shelton. PJ Williams moved. Terrence Newman is now on the team. Darius Slay is now on the team. Olivier Vernon is now on the team. Terrell Suggs is now on the team. Dayon Buchanan is on the team. My man Dayon, love him. And John Abraham is also on the team. We are one Minnesota Viking away from getting plus one to awareness and play rec. Like, that really matters at all. I don't really care. But, like, wow. <laughs> what an insane episode. But this, I don't even know how long this video is going to be. Probably pretty long. But thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Take it easy.